In this topic, I'm going to show you how to determine if an equation is linear or not. Keep in mind, a linear equation means that it will be a straight line if you were to graph it and take a look at it. I'm going to show you how to use a graphing calculator to verify this, and I'll put the link to the calculator that I'm using in the description below. So let's take a look at these four equations here. So in letter A, we have 4x equals negative 5. Is it linear or not? Let's take a look at the calculator. So basically, I'm just going to go here and just type in 4x equals negative 5. And you can see here that I get a vertical line, a green vertical line. Since there's no curves to it, I know this is a linear equation. I would go back to my problem and I just put, yes, it's linear. And then you just do the same thing for the next one. So the next one is 9x minus 6 plus 4y. So I'm going to type that in. So I'm going to hit x to get rid of this. 9x minus 6 plus 4y equals x minus 5 equals x minus 5 and you can see here it's a negative slope and it's a straight line it's a lint therefore I'm gonna put down yes it is linear then the next one we get y plus 7 over x equals 0 so I'm gonna clear this one out y plus 7 over x and then you gotta hit the right arrow key if you want to type in the fraction equals 0 and you can see here we have two curved lines two curved lines therefore for this one I put down no it's not linear it's not a straight line and then the next one 0.02x minus 0.9y so let me clear this out 0.02x minus 0.9y equals 3.3 equals 3.3 and you can see here again straight line it's linear so I go back and then I just put yes the equation is linear and let me just do a, one more example with the fractions I'll just do look at the fractions because sometimes people mess up when they type in the fractions so you can see how I did it so now here we have x divided by 3 so let me clear this so I put x divided by 3 and to put the division sign, I'm just clicking on the forward slash button. So, and then now you see the blinking, the cursor is blinking on three. So you got to hit the right arrow key. So you can start the next term. And then we put minus 5y over 4. So I go on back, I put, so I click here, minus 5y over, so I hit the forward slash key over 4. And then the last part was equal 7. So I put equals 7, and then you can see here, my graph is a straight line. And if you need to zoom in and out, depending on the graph you have, you just I just use the cursor or my mouse, the scroll, the scroll pad on my mouse to move backwards. Or you can hit up here in the upper right hand screen, you can zoom in, hit the plus sign, and zoom out if you don't see the graph for some reason. Otherwise, just double check the way you typed it in. So you can see for this one, we have a straight line. So I would go back. And I'll put yes, this equation is linear. And then you just keep doing the same thing for the rest of them. And that's all you got to do for this topic. Is it a straight line or not?